we're here at the Afterpay Australian Fashion Week for 2022 and we cannot wait to see all the amazing designs from the Aussie designers showcased on the catwalk. And I'm so super excited to see the Indigenous Fashion Parade. Shall we go and check it out, Aaron? Let's do it. Let's go. Congratulations on an amazing show to know how you're feeling after this particular event for 2022. The only word can be really, really proud of the show tonight. Uh, I think exceeded everybody's expectations. Um, the designers were, the, the collections were really mm. great. And we can see that and we witnessed tonight with some of the designers, it's amazing to see that coming out from Australia. So I guess in any way, what would be your message for our national and our international viewers out there? For international and local viewers, it's the confidence. The confidence to be a designer. It's about your, it's about your creativity. It's about your passion. It's about what you do. And bringing your culture into that should be embraced. And I hope what we're very proud of is that we're embracing the culture of our indigenous designers and hopefully supporting an opportunity to open that up to the rest of the world. Well, Amanda, congratulations on such an amazing show and an amazing collection. It's it's called Ripples. That's correct. Yeah. What what inspired Ripples? So I guess Ripples is um, about the so the ripples that we're creating through fashion, to, and it's impacting social change. And we're starting to see people think and feel differently about indigenous products. Um, and really, you know, I'm really, I was really inspired. I'm really inspired by what's been happening in this country in the last 10 years. So that's really what it's about. It's my comment on social change. And I've used two beautiful pieces. So um, this piece of artwork is from a gorgeous young lady named Jess Tiedem, who is from Yuwaraway country, which is Western New South Wales. And the blue pieces are from a Gambangia woman named Helena Geiger. So, you know, like it's, and it's a bit of a balance for me about youth and enthusiasm and recognising that as, you know, our future, but also more mature, sophisticated, um, established type of people. So our, our older people um, have been leading the way and now our younger people are taking the, the lead. So it's really cool. It's about the partnership with the designers. This has always been about an equal partnership yeah. of what David Jones, what we do day to day, yeah. but also what the designers could bring to David Jones. So actually it's never been about, it's always been about what we would learn from each other. And so I think that's what has made the partnership really successful. First and foremost, can I say congratulations on an amazing fashion runway for 2022. How are you feeling at the moment? Thank you. I am feeling so much, I think relief would be the word that I would use. It's been a big build up for the show, a lot of hard work over the last couple of months. And you know, it all comes down really to this one moment of launching a collection. And where better to do it than, you know, at Australian Afterpay Fashion Week. What a great platform. And also what's interesting is some of the designs are really amazing. It's original and it's very earthy feel to it. I feel that's Mother Earth to that. So where did you get your inspiration with your designs? Yeah, um, so I actually hand draw all of our prints um, and each collection has a theme which the prints are centered around. And this year 
I actually drew inspiration from the Mariana Trench and it is the deep sea collection and so it does have a bit of a I guess geographical feel when you see the prints up close and I did also draw um, inspiration from tectonic plates in terms of how they connect, um, clash but also how they you know merge together to create the earth you know as it is but also using that as a deeper metaphor for just humanity and how we connect and clash but we still here we're here connecting